Hello and welcome to another magnificent performance in the Zoomer Hall Concert Series brought to you by Healthy Planet, Live Life Healthy. Now, I'm Bill Anderson from the new Classical FM, and today we're celebrating Jewish Music Week in Toronto with one of Israel's newest musical treasures to play a program called Classical Jazzed Up. Here is the Berkovsky Mirzoev Sadid Trio. Make them welcome.
That's a wonderful piece by uh, Paul Schoenfeld called Cafe Music. We'll talk about Paul, the composer, in uh, just a few moments. First of all, I want to introduce you to these wonderful people uh, as we're live in Zoomer Hall with pianist Michael Burkowski, violinist uh, Julia Mirzoev, and cellist uh, Shulamit Sarid. Those are the folks I want you to tell me, please, and we'll start with you, Michael. How did this trio come to be? Well, over the years, I've collaborated with many of the musicians in Toronto. And actually, Julia accompanied for many events of uh, CICF, as well as the uh, Canadian competition. And uh, I happened to also teach at the Glen Gould School, and that's where I accompanied Sarit for an event for the CICF Canada Israel Cultural Foundation. So over the years, I've met a lot of friends, and this was a great event that it's not just you know good friends, but they're also Israeli, so we can play some Israeli music. <laughs> Now, you are a piano trio, but usually that's a quartet, because none of this would happen without your page turner. So would you please introduce the most important person well, on the set today? she happens to be my wife, so, so oh, it's easy. Works. Carl that Solomon. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's nice to have all of you with us today. Can we talk a bit about the fact that you are a traditional piano trio in, in, in you know, composition, mm -hmm. but with this jazzed-up approach? Uh, what is it that attracted you to the style? And just Shulamit, maybe we'll start with you. Our program features uh, two Israeli composers, uh, Schoenfield and Rechtman, and both of them uh, wrote in uh, jazz style. And the question thus arises, what do these uh, Jewish composers have to do with jazz? Because as we all know, jazz music is originated in the music of the African-American communities in the US, notably in New Orleans. But surprisingly, however, uh, many classical composers who jazzed up classical music were in fact Jewish people. Uh, many composers, including um, George Gershwin, Leonard Bernstein, Copland, Irving Berlin, um, they combined um, classical music music approach with um, jazz influenced styles. It also sounds like it's a lot of fun, Julia. It definitely is. Like we're all primarily, you know, classical musicians. We have, you know, training and degrees in that aspect, but really playing jazz is it's a lot less nerve wracking. There's in a sense it's it is very difficult, but there's a little bit less in demand on perfection, a little bit more on kind of rhythmic improvisation and stylistic kind of flexibility so kind of I like think jazz rhymes with pizzazz I exactly. think exactly yeah. Michael back to you a little bit more about the composer of this cafe music and then we'll hear some more of it uh, Paul Schoenfeld well Paul Schoenfeld he's an American Israeli composer uh, born 1947 actually lived on a kibbutz in Israel and not only he was a brilliant musician but he also taught the Talmud and math uh, he combined a lot of folk animal elements and jazz uh, with classical ideas in his music so it's amazing that we have his music to help classical musicians to sound a bit more jazzy put down the microphones go back to your instruments and once again entertain us please with some music by Paul Schoenfeld cafe music here live in Zoomer Hall
We are live in Zoomer Hall with the Burkowski Mirzoev uh, Sarid Trio, and we're going to continue to celebrate Jewish Music Week in Toronto right after this. Here we are in Zoomer Hall with our concert series, and uh, once again, our special guest trio, Burkowski, Mirzoev, and Sarid, are going to entertain us with some more classical music jazzed up this time. It's by Felix Mendelssohn, his piano trio, number one.
Live in Zimmer Hall, some of the Mendelssohn Piano Trio number one. We'll hear a bit more of it a little bit later, but I do want to uh, remind all of you about the Canadian Israel Cultural Foundation. They support and develop artistic life in Israel as well as showcase Israeli culture in Canada. And for more than 50 years, the foundation has presented the uh, Charette Scholarships to promising young musicians. Now, people like Itzhak Perlman and Pincus Zuckerman are previous recipients, as are two of our guests today, joining this illustrious company, uh, Michael and uh, Shulamit. Congratulations. And Shulamit, tell me, how important has that been? Um, I've been a recipient of the AICF scholarship since 2001. Uh, I also um, got a full scholarship from the AICF to go to Aspen two years ago. Uh, actually, two years ago when I came to Canada, Michael and I performed in a fundraising concert for the CAC, for the Canada Israel Cultural Foundation. And earlier this year, um, I performed in a concert organized by the CACF at the University of Ottawa. And Michael, what have the scholarships meant to you? Well, the scholarship in Israel, that was the thing you had to do every year. You knew if you were a good musician, you won the scholarship. Otherwise, you would have to, to quit your instrument. And uh, luckily, that's, that's, I, I had a lot of pressure. <laughs> a lot of pressure, but yeah. I, I had their support for over five years in Israel. And that I even had their support while I was in New York at Juilliard. I had a scholarship from them. And I played over the years numerous concerts at various embassies, universities, supported by this wonderful foundation. Well, thank you for that. Let's go back to the music that we're here to enjoy today and that Felix Mendelssohn piano trio. And Julia, I'm going to ask you, what is so special about this piece of music, the Felix Mendelssohn piano trio number one? Like, What's attracted this trio to it? beautiful romantic piano trios in the canon of all classical chamber music and I think we specifically picked um, Mendelssohn's piano trio because Mendelssohn actually uh, comes from a Jewish heritage although um, where he lived in Europe at the time um, it was kind of frowned upon and he wouldn't have been successful so they had to baptize him and change the family name to Mendelssohn Bartholdi yeah um, but anyways he was always um, still kind of proud of his heritage and, um, you know, being the great grandson of Moses Mendelssohn, the great Enlightenment of Judaism philosopher. So um, he has very strong Jewish roots in history and in philosophy of Judaism as well. So we thought it was appropriate to include this work. And he is truly one of the great composers of all time. Put down the mics, pick up the instruments, and let's hear more of the Mendelssohn Piano Trio Number 1 Live from Zoomer Hall. Thank you. 
simply delightful. The Mendelssohn Piano Trio Number One Scherzo Movement. Uh, we're uh, live in Zoomer Hall with our Bukowski Mirzaev Sari de Trio, and we're going to continue with more of their music, celebrating Jewish Music Week in Toronto right after this. And now, ladies and gentlemen, once again, here's Daria. <laughs> six minutes to commercial break, six minutes to commercial break. I do have two faces that are going to come in. Come on in, gentlemen. For the whole intro. So these are two cast members from the Hit Parade. Oh, we're actually live, live. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hi. Hi, everyone. <laughs> hi, Webb. Hi, I'm Tom Allison. I'm Simon Spiro, and we are on... Your all-time classic hit parade. Friday nights, coming to you again this fall. <laughs> <laughs> I like so, you guys uh, already. <laughs> so series one is currently on, actually, every Friday night. Uh, but we are busy in rehearsals and uh, production for series two now. So we're actually next door in the other studio rehearsing series two, which is very exciting. Because mm, I get to sing with my favorite guy <laughs> sing. We have a good time. Should we do a little something? Yeah. Why yeah. not? Okay. Yeah. okay. Right. Mm -hmm. Oh, Danny boy. The pipes, the pipes are calling From glen to glen And down the mountainside The summer's gone And all the roses falling it's you, it's you must go, and I shall bide. Well, taste. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. So watch us. It's fun. Yeah. Good show. Great show. Fabulous singer. Mm. Great singer. Mm. <laughs> Fantastic singer. It's usually about seven or eight takes, and especially with these guys, and we get a kick out of them. Yeah. The first seven takes are fun, and then we do the eighth take. <laughs> but the but B-roll, the, the other takes that we do, one of these days we could do a show of the all-time hit parade, or what series. didn't make. A series of the B-rolls. Yeah. yeah. Didn't make it. So with that said, <laughs> we do want to invite you guys again to come and see these gentlemen, plus the rest of the cast, next yep. Monday. Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. We're filming. Come see us. We're filming in this space, in this studio. Bravo, Steven, Bravo. again, will be out there with more information, how you guys can sign up. Two and a half minutes to air. Two and a half minutes. There's another voice oh. in here. Are you hearing voices again? <laughs> I am. Uh, I have tablets for that. It's okay. It's good. Okay. As long as they can get me through next week. <laughs> <laughs> we have It'll a whole good. week of taping shows, so you're all invited. Please. It's going to be a great, great, great week. Monday and Tuesday and Thursday, Thursday and Friday. And you sing with us. And, and you Wednesday will be in the us. clinic. So that'll be very exciting. Fun. Very exciting. You coming? Yeah, you coming? Yes. Yes. Say Woo! yes. Yay. <laughs> Love to see you. Minutes? Thank you, gentlemen. Thanks, guys. Go back to work. All right. <laughs> All right, bye. Thank you. Thank you. Bravo. Do we have time for one question? No, but I have a joke. You have a joke? <laughs> yeah, I have a question. I have a question. So you take a piece of, like Mendelssohn and you jazz it up. Would you be able to just show how it would be played classically and then how you jazz it up? 90 seconds to air, 90 seconds. Okay, maybe, maybe I'll take a, we, we didn't quite jazz up this one, but uh, there are uh, there are motifs, uh, for example, from Mozart's, you probably know. Yes, yeah, so you kind of play with it. All right, hurry up and wait time. Okay, joke time. Joke? Okay, can you tell me a joke? Yeah. I don't know what this joke is. 
you want the mic? Do you want the mic? Five minutes of fame. No, you have less than. Okay, four okay, seconds. fast. Okay, two construction workers are having lunch, and one construction worker says to the other one, I'm really jealous. Every day you have something else for lunch. Seconds. So he said, Well, why don't you have something else for lunch? He says, um, He says, Every day you have lasagna or chicken, and all I have is a, a bologna sandwich on uh, white bread. He says, Well, tell your wife to make something else. He says, What wife? I make it myself. Stand by, Bill. Eight, seven, six, seven, eight, 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 five, four. We're back live in Zoomer Hall as our concert series continues with something called Jazzicals. That's kind of like classical and jazz all mixed up. Jazzicals, written by an Israeli pianist and composer named Ilan uh, Rechtman. Once again, here is the Berkowski Mirzoev Sarid Trio. Take it away. The title of that movement from Jazzicals is Sweet. It's uh, by a composer named Elan Rechtman. And I'm going to ask uh, Shulamit to tell us a bit more about this composer. Um, Elan Rechtman is 
Hartman, born in 1963, is an Israeli composer and pianist. Um, as a pianist, he performed with the Israel Philharmonic Orchestra, the Boston Pops, the New World Symphony Orchestra. Um, as a composer, his pieces have been commissioned uh, by renowned uh, conductors such as uh, Zubin Mehta and Lauren Mazel. And Jazz Calls comprises 20 miniatures for piano trio uh, in a jazzy style. Uh, these short movements are written in like contrasting moods, for example, sweet, melancholy, cool, uh, sexy. And some of them are dances like tap dance, uh, swing. Great fun indeed. And we're going to ask you to play a few more in a moment. But before I let you get away, you're all accomplished professional musicians. Uh, you both, or all of you at least, have both uh, Israeli and Canadian connections, and so I think you're eminently well qualified to comment on a phrase that I've heard for many years. Music is a universal language. Can we start with you, Julia? Yeah, I think um, with this whole theme with, um, you know, these uh, Jewish composers taking and kind of standardizing jazz music and kind of um, writing it down, as previously it was more of kind of in improvisational techniques. So I think really the fact that all these cultures are coming together and playing, you know, these these genres of music and we're considering it like world music. And really it's kind of just, it's very um, unified. So I think that's why it's a universal language. Shulamit, your comments? Um, I'm Israeli and thanks to my music, I've been very lucky to study in Canada at the Glen Gould, uh, School uh, for the past two years. And I'm about to start my doctorate at McGill, so everything is thanks to my music. And Michael? Well, I, I think today, if you hear this music, I think you can definitely hear that this is a representation of our time. If you heard Mozart in his time, uh, you knew that you were in the 18th century. So maybe if Mozart was alive today, he would write something like this. Uh, so for me, world music is this kind of music. Play some more jazzicals for us, please. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, our special guests here in Zoomer Hall.
guys are really good. You know that? Terrific stuff. Ladies and gentlemen, we're live in Zoomer Hall with a celebration of uh, Jewish Music Week, and I do want to remind our audience that there are still lots of chances for you to attend some terrific musical performances right through this coming weekend. I'm going to give you a website where you can check all this out. It's www.jewishmusicweek.com. And as they say in radio, I will repeat that, www.jewishmusicweek.com. For details, you'll get all that. Thank you again to our wonderful special guest. How about a great round of applause once more for the uh, berkowski mirzoev Sadid trio what great music, what great talent. Come back anytime, okay? We'd love to see you again. Our program today has been brought to you by Healthy Planet. Live life healthy. I'm Bill Anderson. See you next time in Zoomer Hall.